Hello and welcome to your weekly weather app for Sunday the 24th of February, the first for 2019, so it's good to see you again. Extropical cyclone Omar is moving slowly northwards in the Coral Sea, but is still making its presence felt. Abnormally high tides, dangerous surf and damaging winds are a risk along the southern Queensland and northern New South Wales coasts, with conditions set to ease early this week. Meanwhile, a low pressure trough extending through western and northern Australia is helping to keep warm and dry air over central parts of the continent, particularly evident in the building heatwave conditions across inland Western Australia. This is also enhancing the bushfire risk through southern WA, with fires ongoing in this area, as well as in parts of the southeast and in northern New South Wales. As we move into the week, shower activity will continue in the northeast, with XTC OMA directing strong and moist southeasterly flow onto the coast. Although a monsoon break period continues across the top end, some isolated shower and thunderstorm activity is expected here as well. The remainder of the country will stay dry, with that heat across Western Australia and central parts of the country beginning to push back into the eastern states. Tasmania will see some isolated shower activity on Tuesday as a weak cold front moves across the southeast. Onshore flow will maintain slightly milder conditions along Australia's east coast as well. From Wednesday, the high pressure system in the Tasman Sea will extend a ridge back into the bight, enhancing warm and settled conditions across most of the country. Unfortunately, this means that we don't expect much rainfall in areas away from the coast. A stronger cold front is expected to reach the southwest late in the week, but it will take some time for these cooler conditions to settle in. And that's it for this week, but you can check the latest forecasts on our website where they're updated twice a day. See you next time.